Welcome friends. I'm Jen Hillman. Thank you so much for joining me for this very special chair yoga stretch video. So I know that sometimes when you are in chronic pain, it's not easy to get down onto the floor. Or if you're stretching at your desk or taking a quick break at work, you might just want to do some stretching right here in your chair. So I wanted to make this video to show you some really simple stretches that you can do to really open up the neck and shoulders and upper back right from the comfort of your chair. You could even do this in your car at a traffic light or sitting in traffic. So wherever you're sitting, you can still get the benefits of some stretching and movement. All right, so make yourself comfortable in a chair or you could be sitting on the floor and get just as much benefit. So wherever you find yourself, go ahead and take a seat. By the way, did you know that you can now take live classes with me online? That's right, every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and all classes are by donation. So hop on over to jenhillman.com and get yourself signed up. I'll see you on the map and enjoy your flow. So in your chair, you're going to want to sit forward towards the front edge of the chair so that your feet are flat on the floor. And today I'm using a chair that doesn't have any arms and that just gives me a little bit more freedom of movement as we're stretching. If your chair has arms, you can still work with that and you may you know, experiment and see which type of chair works best for you. But wherever you are, you want to sit forward towards the front edge of your chair with your feet flat on the floor. And this allows you to lift up in your spine. You can even slightly tip your pelvis forward, giving you a slight adjustment in your seat. And this will accentuate the curves in your back, allowing you to sit all the way up tall, lifting up through the crown of your head with relative ease. And as you find this space in your spine and connect to this upward lift, you may notice more space in your belly for a deeper breath. So go ahead and dive into that deep breath, allowing your breath to get deeper and longer. And this simple act of slow, deep breathing with a nice long spine and feet flat to the floor is a wonderful technique that can almost instantly help you to feel more grounded, more centered, and more calm. And this is the perfect place to open our practice, moving into the body from that quiet, still place inside yourself. So with your hands on your lap, we're going to inhale together, pressing against your legs, lift up through your spine. So we're reaching up even taller, lifting and stretching up through the crown of your head. Now as you exhale, just gently roll your right ear to your right shoulder and circle your chin down to center. And then on your inhale, Roll your left ear to your left shoulder, opening up through the right side of your neck. And we'll exhale and slowly roll your chin back down to center. So we're moving with a nice, slow, deep breath here. Inhale your right ear to your right shoulder. And exhale to roll your chin back down the middle. We'll go again to the left. Inhale, rolling to the left side. And exhale and slowly roll your chin down to center. One more cycle on both sides. Let's inhale, rolling your right ear to the right shoulder. Anchor down with the left shoulder. Then exhale and roll your head down the center. Nice and easy, full exhale. And we'll inhale and roll your left ear to the left shoulder. 
and anchor down that right side. Then we'll exhale and roll your chin right back down the middle. And this time we're going to pause, just letting your head gently hang. Keep lifting up through your spine, all the way up through your shoulders and upper back, and just let the head fold forward. Then circle your hands back behind your head and interlace your fingers there, really making sure that you cradle the back of your head. Now gently let your elbows relax down towards the floor so the weight of your arms is giving you a gentle traction as you stretch along the back of your neck. You can breathe here and just enjoy this place of stillness or you can start to bring a little bit of movement into the stretch, just gently turning your chin from right to left. Move as slow as your body likes and allow yourself to really feel the subtlety in the shift of the movement as you gently turn your head side to side. And whenever you feel complete, you can let your chin rest back to center. Now keeping your hands right where they are, we're gonna gently lift the head back up to center then open your elbows out wide. So really spread your wings here, stretching your elbows as wide apart as you can. Root down through your feet. Inhale and lift up through the crown of your head. And as you exhale, gently begin to press your head back into your hands. So you're slowly leaning back, rolling your gaze open towards the sky. Keep stretching the elbows wide to increase the stretch. Lift up and out of your waist so you're supported through your core. And it's just the neck, the upper back, and the chest curling open. Then slowly return to center. Fold your head back down the middle and let your elbows relax down to the floor. Breathe slow and deep here. Letting the back of the neck and the top of the shoulders open. On your next inhale, we'll gently roll your head back up to center. This time, keep hugging your elbows close by your head. Now we're going to do the same idea, just hugging the elbows in. So start by rooting down in your feet. Inhale to lift up out of your waist. Then exhale and gently lean your head back into your hands, reaching your elbows up towards the sky. Lift up out of your waist. Stretch your chest upward as you lean your head back into your hands. So this is a new stretch in the upper back and shoulders. Slowly stretch, leaning back to your edge, and we'll gently rise, floating your head back up to center, and we'll go ahead and fold your chin all the way back down to your chest. Letting your arms be heavy Increasing the stretch along the back of your neck. And if you want to turn your chin side to side again, you can experiment with that and see how it feels. Or you can just let your head rest right down the middle and breathe into that stretch. When you feel ready, you'll slowly release your hands back down into your lap and gently roll your head from side to side, right to left, just like in the beginning. Some slow, gentle movements guided by your breath, just rolling your head side to side. Inhale to one side, and exhale down the middle. And when you feel complete, we'll gently roll your head back up to center, coming all the way up. Now we're gonna to start to do a little deeper stretching across the upper part of the chest and into the shoulders. 
So place your, well, let's do the right side first. So place your left hand down onto the edge of your chair. So you're just giving yourself a little support there on the left side. Then bring your right hand up and back behind your head. We'll inhale, press against your chair to lift up through your spine and grow tall. Then as you exhale, begin to lean towards the left side. Now this isn't just like a full lean out of your chair, but try to lift up out of your waist, staying relatively connected to your midline. And as you lean up and over, it's really coming from the chest and shoulders and like the rib cage opening up. Rotate your gaze towards the sky and gently press your head against your hand. This will deepen the stretch into the shoulder joint as you lean up and over towards that left side. Stretch up and over with your right elbow, really opening up through the ribs. And we'll slowly rise and return to center. This time, sweep your right hand across to your left knee. We're taking a gentle twist here. Then rotate your gaze towards the right shoulder. So you'll look as far to the right side as you can until you feel the stretch. And there's any number of places that you may feel a stretch here. It could be along the left side of your net. You could feel something along the right side or into the shoulder, just depending on where you're holding tension. So just twist to the left, look to the right, and breathe into the sensation that you feel. Then we'll gently release back to the center, coming back to neutral. You can let your hands rest on your lap. Take a full round of breath here, breathing in and out. And then we'll prepare for the second side, bringing your right hand down onto the edge of your chair. We'll circle the left arm up and back behind your head. Inhale to lift up, pressing against your chair to give you a little bit more height. We'll exhale and gently lean in towards that right side. Remember, you want to lift up out of the waist, lift up out of your torso so that this arc is really happening in the upper part of the ribs and along the side body. Again, you can rotate your gaze towards the sky, press your head against your hand to increase the stretch in the shoulder joint. Lean up and over towards the right side, stretching through that left elbow. You get a deep stretch between the ribs. And we'll slowly return back to center and sweep that left hand across to your right knee. Now make sure that you stabilize that right leg so you're not just collapsing the leg here. That's why we stand your feet flat against the floor. So your leg gives you a little bit of stability. So you have some leverage to twist. And then rotate your gaze over the left shoulder, looking as far to the left side as you can until you feel whatever sensation you feel. And it may be different. You may feel it in a different place on this side. So this is just a chance to notice and observe what's coming up for you in your body. Breathe space, breathe openness. And we'll gently release back to the front. You can place your hands onto your lap and take a couple deep breaths. Notice how you feel. Notice the spaciousness in your chest, in your shoulders, in the back of your neck, in your head. Then we'll inhale and reach your arms up towards the sky. Really reach up through your fingertips like you were gonna grab onto a monkey bar or reaching for something off the top shelf. Lift up out of your waist. Hug your arms close to your midline as you stretch your fingertips high, 
oh, feeling so much space in your spine. And we'll slowly circle your arms down and around. And I want you to reach back and grab on to the back edge of your chair. So you can adjust how high or how low your arms come based on your own flexibility. You're gonna take a hold of the back edge of your chair, rooting down through your feet and sitting forward on the front edge of your chair. We'll inhale to lift up your spine, open through your chest, and roll your shoulders onto your back. Then lean your chest forward and open through your gaze, holding on to the back of your chair. You feel a stretch across the front of your chest. Breathe into that stretch, opening into your lungs. And we'll slowly return to neutral. And to round out our practice, you're just going to slowly begin to fold forward over your legs. If you need to adjust back in your chair a little bit, you can, just so that you feel comfortable folding down over your legs. Now you may, you know, everybody may fold forward at a different level. That's okay. But as you bow down over your legs, let your head relax. So you want to feel your head is heavy and your shoulders are relaxed as you fold down over your legs, just letting your whole spine stretch. Then slowly begin to walk your hands up your legs to your knees. Slowly unroll your spine using your arms for support. And gently roll yourself all the way up to sitting. Now to close out our practice, go ahead and scoot back in your chair as comfortably as you can, but still maintaining your feet on the floor. So now you just have a little more support under your legs. Let your hands rest onto your lap and just close your eyes here and breathe. Pay special attention to the sensations that you feel in your body. Even if there's some areas that still feel tight, just notice, no judgment. But perhaps you feel a sense of more space and a deeper breath. And perhaps even your mind is a little more quiet and still. Feel free to stay and enjoy this stillness. Give yourself this time to meditate and rest. And when you feel ready to come back into the world, just slowly move your body around, kind of reawakening and inviting movement back into your body. And let a gentle smile cross your face, feeling love and gratitude for yourself for taking this time to stretch and to breathe and to take good care of yourself. It's such an honor to be your guide and to light the way to peace and to healing. I wish you all the best and I hope to see you in a live class soon. Until next time, namaste.